Well, St. Vincent de Paul is taking steps to ensure the homeless and less fortunate in the Billings community are a main priority. Q2 Shaquille Cozart has more on how they are literally stepping up to the plate. St. Vincent de Paul is a charity office in Billings that provides food, clothing, rental assistance, and works directly with the Social Security Administration to manage money for those who are less fortunate, homeless, and are not able to properly manage their Social Security checks. It's really opened our eyes to the value of making sure that we open up our doors to, to volunteers um, of all, uh, uh, not only uh, age ranges, but also uh, poverty levels. And so uh, we just really believe this is something that we'll, we'll continue to do in the future. St. Vincent de Paul's Rental Assistance Office can pay up to one month of rental fees for those who are unable to make their payments due to uncontrollable circumstances. They also pay rent for those that are currently in sober living facilities. We have about 14 people right now in sober living that we're paying their rent for this for this month that and that gives them a month that they can actually get back on their feet turn their lives around and start living a productive life so that's one of our programs in my office the charity office works directly with the social security administration to assist those enrolled in the payee program the program helps those unable to properly manage Social Security checks by releasing a certain amount of their money to each recipient depending on their spending history. All of our accounts are being held at the Western Security Bank over here on, on uh, Broadway and First Avenue North and they've been uh, very kind in allowing us to pre-write checks. We, we take those checks over to the bank in the morning and then our clients come over later uh, during the day, pick up their spending money directly at the bank rather than coming over here to, to get a check that they previously were picking up here and then walking it over to the bank. So now they just go right to the bank in the morning, pick up their check, and we write a little note so they know what, what day to come back for their next check. Along with other programs, St. Vincent de Paul serves breakfast, lunch, and dinner to those in need. They now serve about 7,000 meals per day, seven days a week. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, things have changed in their dining hall, but volunteers stepped up to continue to help those in the Billings community. Um, one of the neat things that we've learned uh, since COVID um, is that the homeless population um, that we serve, that we typically would have, would have fed during these times, um, has stepped up and they are now serving the meals. And so uh, during COVID, what we, most of our volunteers, almost all of them in fact, left the building for, for you know to be able to shelter uh, in home um, and so many of our homeless people we just said listen if you want this food ministry to continue you're going to need to step up and and, and great they said you know yes graciously they, they they accepted the challenge and so we've had almost 20 to 30 people in the last 10 weeks that have really just done an amazing job of serving the food uh, prepping the food taking temperatures everybody coming through that doorway making sure everybody's washing their hands wiping down tables and it's just been a beautiful thing to watch in billings shaquille cozart mtn news and for more information on this story and ways to help you can visit the ktvq website